What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the Hershey Addict and today we have a big time breaking news update regarding Hershey Park regarding what could be the 2025 new ride. That's right. We're talking about what could be coming new to Hershey Park next year because a big time magazine that has proven to be credible in the past just may have leaked what's coming to Hershey Park next year. So for starters, let's just set the ice here. Let's break the ice. For those that were not aware, Hershey Park announced they were closing and demolishing their amphitheater. This was an area that was pretty much used for shows. They also incorporated it for Hershey Park Dark Nights. But for the most part, this was just a big area of land that kind of sat beneath Skyview, kind of adjacent to Great Bear. That was kind of unused. It's right next to the Outlook Cafe. All have footage playing of the area while I'm speaking over this. But Hershey Park announced that this area would be getting demolished. Um, but they never really uh, alluded to what would be coming next. All we knew for certain is that around opening day, they placed up some signs around the area that read construction is in full swing. So that kind of just tells you right there that a new ride is probably going to be coming just based off the wordplay. Construction is in full swing, part in our dust. I mean, that just screams brand new ride. So now here's where the magazine comes into play. And this comes from The Sun Magazine, which for those that do not know, is a local news magazine out of the Hummelstown Hershey area. Fun fact, my grandmother actually used to write for the Suns. So this kind of just comes full circle for me, but regardless, I'm going to read exactly what it reads from the Sun magazine. It reads as follows. From singing to screaming, the amphitheater at Hershey Park is in the process of being torn down, and now we know it will be built in its place. A source familiar with the situation has told the Sun that the music venue will be replaced by a screaming swing, which is manufactured by SNS Worldwide, the same company that made the Triple Towers. When I first read this, obviously I was excited. A screaming swing would be a great, great fit in Hershey Park. They really don't have a high thrill swing ride. Um, they only have that low thrill swing ride. So a high thrill swing ride would be great. And it makes sense with the sign. Construction is in full swing. That full swing analogy there that kind of alludes to a swing ride. So all signs are pointing to this absolutely being 100% true. I would be absolutely shocked if this does not come, come out in 2025. Um, but let's talk about it because there's a lot of different things going on here. Before we talk about the new rod, I want to talk about Hershey Park's entertainment side of things, like the shows, because the shows at Hershey Park have really taken hit. The Hershey Park used to have so many shows. They had the character quiz show. They have the uh, the Sea Lion show, which is still there. But now with the removal of the amphitheater, uh, Hershey Park really doesn't have a whole lot of shows left. They have the Sea Lion show, and that's pretty much it. You have that and the characters walking around. Hershey Park used to have... So many shows go on in the amphitheater and the, uh, and, the, and the other music box. I'm blanking on the name. I'll throw it on the screen now. But there was another um, auditorium that they would play shows in. Then, of course, the Sea Lion show. There used to be so many shows, and that's a big part of the park for families and for younger ones. Even for, for older guests, I like going to shows. So Hershey Park is, again, kind of abandoning the entertainment and show side and just going full, full on on the thrill side. So let me know in the, in the comments down below your thoughts about that. Hershey Park just kind of abandoning the show stuff. Would you like to see more shows added to Hershey Park? I think they should. Um, just with the, the Hershey's and the chocolate theme, I feel like there's so many potential for some really good entertainment shows. But again, we're losing another um, show location that used to be used to play shows, which I just thought was interesting. But let's talk about the Screaming Swing. I was really excited when I saw this. We see these rides kind of all across America. I think it's a great fit for Hershey Park. The only thing... Um, I'm really worried about these scrimmage swings. And sometimes the capacity on these is not the best. It depends how many seats across um, that the rival sit. That'll be a big part in determining like a capacity. But since um, the ride itself can only seat so many and there's only one train that can go at once, capacity kind of scares me a little bit, but not too much just because there's so many things to do at Hershey Park where the guests are usually spread out pretty well, but just something to keep an eye on. And in regards to the area of the park this is in, this is such a great area. This is kind of just an overlooked part of the uh, of of uh, the hollow that's really hasn't been used at all lately um you have comet then you have that bridge over there um again all footage playing with the area i'm talking about but then you have that little bridge and nothing's really been used in that area for for so long like i said dark Knights use it but just kind of a weird walkway that kind of connects pioneer frontier to the hollow so to finally get like a proper ride there something for guests to do right there is is such is such a good sign obviously you have the teacups there you have the sweet swing um, but now to have like a proper big time ride to be in that small area of the park, I think could be a great, great fit. But overall, I'm really excited for this announcement. What do you think about the Screaming Swing coming to Hershey Park? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Love to hear what you guys have to say. Make sure to drop a like on the video. If you love Hershey Park, this is your number one place for you. I talk about all things Hershey. Breaking news like you just saw, reports, updates. Long story short, if you love Hershey Park, this is the channel for you. Above that, that's going to do it. I hope you guys have a great 
Rest your day and hope to see you all soon from the Hershey app. Peace. What a wonderful world.